Hello, it's Phil, the worship survival guy. Worship renewal shouldn't be that complicated. King David sang that God's goodness lifted him out of a slimy pit, put his feet on a rock, and gave him a new song, one that impacted many lives. Our psalmist knew that praise and hope are siblings. He wanted Israel's worship restored. He wanted the Ark of the Covenant back home. The Ark was where God and man connected. Let's do a quick review. Israel lost the Ark to crazy Philistines. Philistines are dumb as a box of rocks. First, they loaded the Holy Ark of the Testimony onto an ox cart. They paraded the presence of God on boards and big wheels. Bad idea, really bad idea. Finally, the ark ends up in some guy's barn. You can't make this stuff up. Now, back to King David. When he retrieved the ark, again, to restore worship, David followed the Philistine example. He used a cart, boards, and big wheels. That was a real bummer for a guy named Uzzah. Read it. Wisely, David went back to the Bible. He learned that the ark needed to be carried reverently, lovingly, on the shoulders of godly leaders. David's epiphany? Leadership is a big deal in worship. That parable is painful. We have used boards and big wheels to help us with worship renewal. Beautiful conferences, summits, wise authors, droning words like pipelines, missional, relevant, innovative, disruptive, transformational, postmodern, blah, blah, blah. Friends, Boards and big wheels might not be the experts on God's presence. Maybe God is, do you suppose? Unless you've been off planet, you can see that our experts are melting down. Go back and Google the big wheels from the last 20 years of leadership events. Look at the pattern of toxic leadership, spiritual abuse, unchecked egos, book sale scandals, college admission bribes, Yuck! Bad stuff happens if we carry the ark on an ox cart. Bad stuff happens when we adopt worldly ideas for spiritual objectives. By the numbers, our pastors now train for ministry longer than they sustain in ministry. That bears repeating. Yuck! I know for a fact that lots of you feel like us are right now, and you are not crazy. Wheels are coming off the cart, and you're reaching for the ark. Stop. Step back. Learn like David did. Get wisdom. The son of David wants to see worship restored just like you do. You're on the winning team. Standing Stones Field Shepherds talk to guys like Uzzah every day. Free, safe, confidential, different. Let's talk. Keep the praises going, but don't go it alone. Mm -hmm.